Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. As you can tell, I have a suitcase right here and that's because I'm leaving the state of California for the first time in three years tomorrow. I'm catching a flight at 8.14 a.m. tomorrow from SFO to Philadelphia and then we're gonna be driving from Philadelphia to Haynesport, New Jersey, which is where my grandma lives. Some of you might remember her from some of my older videos. She's visited us here a few times in the last few years, but I haven't actually been there since I was 17. And then a bunch of my other relatives are also gonna be coming, so it's gonna be pretty fun. But I might freeze to death because I'm a Californian, so I actually asked people on Instagram for some packing advice so I'm going to be packing some of the things that you all recommended for me. And I also just want to catch you all up on some things that have been happening recently. So without further ado, let's get into the packing. So this is my suitcase. It's one of the hard shell kinds. I've had this for four or five years and I really like it. So the first thing that a lot of people suggested that I bring is a jacket. I don't wear coats that often because I live in San Jose and it doesn't really get that cold. I'm usually fine with a hoodie like this and sometimes I'll throw in a jacket on top of that. But for this trip, I'm going to be bringing this North Face jacket. I think I actually got this a few years ago on Black Friday and I think it's in one of my Black Friday videos. Probably only worn this a handful of times since I got it, but it's really nice and warm and it has a hood on it. I'm not gonna put this in my suitcase because it'll literally take up the entire suitcase. So I'm just gonna wear it to the airport instead. The next thing that people recommended was a hat and gloves. So I have this Christmassy hat and these gloves, which I really like. And I think I'm gonna put those in my backpack because I might need them right when I get there. In addition to the suitcase, I'm just gonna be wearing my regular school backpack so I can carry my laptop and cameras and that kind of stuff. So I'm gonna put my hat and gloves in here just, and then for clothes because it's obviously gonna be a lot colder than it usually is here. So I'm gonna bring some some hoodies and some sweaters so I'm actually gonna try to be a good packer and roll these up well but while I'm packing all this stuff up I just want to talk a little bit about school and work because as you saw in my last video I finished all my finals recently and today was also my last day of work of 2018 as far as school goes I'm still waiting for my grades I think I did pretty well in most of my classes but I guess I'll just have to wait and see if I do get my grades back before I post this video I'll answer a clip about that here so I'm at the airport I'm in this really fancy lunch thing and I just checked my grades I got two B's two A minuses and an A plus in 100W. So I'm really happy with these and everything's good. Grades aren't everything to me. I personally care more about what I learned during the semester than the grades that I actually got. And I honestly really feel like I learned a lot from most of my classes. There was only one class out of five that I didn't like, and that was mostly just because the professor was really confusing. But my other four classes were awesome. I was genuinely excited to go to them, and I feel like I learned a lot. I feel like the professors really make or break a class, and thankfully I had a lot of great professors this semester, so I'm really thankful for that. I'm probably gonna make another video about this at some point, but I really learned a lot about strategic communications and strategy in general, and it changed my views on a lot of things. I definitely had a lot of epiphanies this semester, which was good. The first few semesters of college just felt like high school part too for me and I was just getting really frustrated and bored but now I feel like I'm really learning and growing and I'm just really happy about that. So next semester I'll be taking some classes that will hopefully be good as well but I guess I'll just have to wait and see. I feel like you never really know what a class is going to be like until you actually get there. And then as far as work goes, I'm still working at Transportation Solutions at SJSU. And it's honestly one of my favorite jobs that I've ever had in my entire life. I went into it thinking that it would just be a typical student assistant job. And I honestly expected it to be kind of boring. And like any job, there are boring moments. But I've really learned a lot about transportation policy from it. And I've even been learning about urban planning from one of my coworkers who's a grad student in the urban planning department. And if you follow me on social media, you probably know that I've been going to a lot of community meetings and board meetings about transportation in the Bay Area. I just like learning about these sorts of things and another great thing about my job is my coworkers. Everyone at my work is really nice and awesome and my manager is really awesome and supportive and I feel like he genuinely cares about my future. He encourages me to go to meetings and learn about transportation policy in general. He's also trying to convince me to go to grad school which is honestly a topic for a whole other video but it's just really cool to be working in a supportive environment and working with people that care about my future because I haven't experienced that at a lot of jobs that I've worked at in the past. I know that a lot of you are probably not very interested in politics and you don't care about any of this stuff but it's important to me so I'm going to continue to talk about it and in the new year I want to try to have a good balance of content I want to make videos that you all want me to make but I also want to make videos that I want to make so I think I have pretty much everything packed there's still a few more things that I need to put in my suitcase but I'm probably going to do most of that in the morning because it's mostly toiletries and things that I don't have two of so I think I'm going to end the video here thank you all so much for watching happy holidays and I'll see all of you very soon with a new video goodbye <laughs>